What's up Diva fam and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Obviously you can tell by the title down below we are doing my last subscription unboxing for the month. It is going to be Ipsy, obviously you can tell by the title, and this will also be the giveaway video as well. So for those of you who don't know, I do post videos two three times a week. Um, they are beauty, lifestyle, and makeup videos. I also do giveaways every single month. Um, the ones I do for my subscription boxes, which is in this video, are for US only because they're a little bit more on the heavier side and they do cost a lot to ship sometimes, even within the US, depending on where they're going. And if I shipped it international, that would cost me an arm and a leg. So, but I do also do international giveaways for you guys as well who are international. Every single time I hit a hundred tier of my subscribers, I will always do an a international giveaway as well um, but I'm also in the middle of decluttering my makeup collection even though I'm getting more makeup as I declutter um, but I will be doing a giveaway in at the end of that video as well and I will probably open that one up to international so definitely go ahead and keep an eye on for that one for as well I think how I ended up doing two giveaways in that video just to um, you know appreciate everyone so definitely again like I said keep an eye out for that video and without further ado let's just go ahead and jump into this but before we do that you know the gist if you like videos like this drop this video a big thumbs up because you know it helps me out so so much don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my youtube channel because you know you want to and don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below so you never miss a video with me your girl Sandra D and let's just go ahead and get into this all right so like I said this is the last unboxing or unbagging for this month, this is the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. This is the middle tier of Ipsy. This is costing about 26 something. I think because I upped the prices too, just like how BoxyCharm did. Duh, why wouldn't they? I guess they were going to since they combined their inventory and are able to give us different products. But anyways, so this is where you get five full-size products. You do a customized quiz. I will always have a link down below. I don't, only thing I kind of kickback I get is just like points towards more makeup. So if that's what you want to go ahead and do to support me, you want to sign up for Ipsy, please make sure you go ahead and do that. But then they also have two other tiers. They have like the $12 or $13 one, which just gets like a bag and like sample sizes and occasionally a full size product. Then you've got the Glam Bag X, which will, um, if you subscribe to this one, you can also do Glam Bag X and that one is a quarterly box. That's the big box that's curated by a celebrity makeup artist or a celebrity of some sort, but obviously in this one, we will always get five full size products. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump into this and see what we got. So um, I will tell you, I did get add-ons for this month. Again, like I did last time. Last time I kind of forgot what add-ons I got, so I'm definitely gonna go ahead and get onto my phone really quickly because it will tell me, unlike BoxyCharm, for some reason, Ipsy does tell me what add-ons I got. BoxyCharm just forgets if I add stuff in. Um, so that's weird, but they do. So let me sign on to my Ipsy really quickly because I was definitely unprepared when we started this video for sure. So come on. Load up at a girl. Okay, here we go. Glam Bag Plus. So I let's see, what are my add-ons in here? I did do I got two add-ons. Why I did, I don't know why. I just felt like it. Okay. And then I do see the items that I picked. So the two add-ons that are not going to be a part of this box are going to be the Tatcha Little Mini Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. I forgot how much I paid for this. So let me look that up really quick. It was either $3 or $5. Again, um, I got this for a steal. So I think I paid $3 for this. It's five milliliters. Um, but I mean, that's a steal to try this out without having to buy like the full size product. I'm interested. You know I am. It does have a sweet like smell to it and a slight sweet taste to it. Okay. Um, again, that will go really quickly. So I don't want to overly spray that. I want to give it like a fair try. Um, but give my makeup just a little bit of a refresher. And then the other add on it looks that I purchased was, I think it's at the bottom of this bag. I think it's right here. Okay. This, I guess I definitely paid $3 for this. It's the Winky Lux Prep Peeper Perfect Peeper Perfect um, 
eyeshadow base. So I was wondering if this was going to be kind of like a skin colored eyeshadow base, which it is. Um, I don't want to use overly use it because I do know that you can kind of use this to carve out to do a... Um, why does my nose always itch when we film? Um, to do... Oopsies. That was my Ulta bag on the floor. I went to Ulta recently because 21 days of Ulta are happening right now at the moment. Um, and that bag just fell over. Oh well, I don't think anything really broke in it, so we should be fine. Anyways, so yeah, that definitely looks like that can kind of be that type of skin tone um, eyeshadow primer. I've always wanted to buy the P. Louise one because I see so many people talk about it. Um, Ali Dawson, obviously Michaela. So I've always been intrigued. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in my everyday drawer just so we can give these products a try. Um, but yeah, so there's that. Now actually getting into this bag. Crazy part is what I hate is that they really don't give you, they give you a pamphlet, but it really doesn't say much to like what you get in it and like the prices. I wish they did that, how BoxyCharm does that, because I feel like with any anything else they put on here is just a waste. Like I, whoever, does anyone really read this or do anything with this? Um, it's just talking about dy dynamic skin duos and like different things of combos. Um, get to know your glam bag plus picks valued at $120. So especially we're supposed to get $120 out of this. Um, you call the shots with add-ons. Just talks about how there's 80% off faves, brands that you love. Um, and then also follow us on Instagram. Um, stay up to date on launches, brand giveaways, and chances to win $4,000. And then it also says deals go live. Um, this on the second. Wait. Set your alarm. These deals go live. Ipsy.com at 9 a.m. ET on the second until 6 p.m. ET on the 3rd. So 80% off add-ons will start always at the beginning of the month, of the following month, and that's just kind of how that goes. Anyways, okay, moving on or moving backwards. So let's go ahead and dive into this and see what we've got. So the first item that says um, that I got in here is going to be the R Plus Co Velvet Cotton Touch, Cotton Touch Texture Balm. So this is what it looks like for us. This is the full size product. It is three fluid ounces. It says it gives your hair, it, it gives all hair types soft, touchable volume texture and hold with a blend of cotton extract. The ingredient helps to improve hair texture and manageability. Smooth vitamin B and shine boosting plant oils. How to use, work a small amount through damp and dry hair and then air dry or heat style as desired. More reasons you'll love it. It's a vegan and cruelty free. Um, and then about the brand founded by a group of ind industries most sought after hairstylist R Plus Co is making waves in the hair scene with playful packaging and products that work really well. And again, this is a full size product and it is worth $34. All right, so as we back out of that and have to go back to the main screen, then we've got another item here that is for us. Um, and this was, I guess, one of the items that I picked. Um, it is the MOTD Cosmetics. It is a clean brand. It is a highlighting powder in Lucid Moon. So let's go ahead and get this out of the packaging. Again, it is a full size product um, for us. Let's just go let's go ahead and see what the packaging looks like, what the color looks like. Um, sometimes they give us really good options in Ipsy, and other times they just don't. So I just feel like sometimes I get they want us to branch out and like and try out different brands. But like if it's not a brand I can get my hands on very easily, such as like inside of Ulta or Sephora or at the drugstore, sometimes I just don't go through the hassle of like ordering outside of it. So this is what it looks like, if you guys can tell. Obviously I do have the ring light on and my bright lights, so sometimes it might wash it out just a little bit. It seems like a really, you know, beautiful um, highlighter, but I don't need any more highlighters right now at the moment. Um, packaging is very practical. It's in a cardboard container. It does have this elastic so it stays closed because it doesn't have a magnet in it. Um, so there is that and then let's see what the price is for this. So again, this is full size. It is seven grams um, and it is $24. Has anyone ever heard of this brand? Would you pay $24 for this? I mean, it is a really big 
packaging but like Ofra's highlighters are like mm, so good and I believe those are like $18 so I would definitely go for that one but for you guys I will give it to you so that'll be in this month's giveaway um, for this month let me go ahead and put it back in the packaging just so that I have that kind of set aside um, and already in a bubble wrap so it doesn't explode or it doesn't break or anything else I like that okay so two other products that are going to be in here for us looks like we have a Gerard Cosmetics Hydro Matte Lipstick this is in the shade 1995 is what it looks like um, obviously we know Gerard Cosmetics is a clean brand now, I've never owned anything by Gerard Cosmetics. I remember when Gerard, Gerard Cosmetics was like the brand for like influencers back in the day to um, collaborate with, but I've never tried the brand. I've always been intrigued to do it. So let's just go ahead and open this up. I can't tell if it's like a chemically smell or if it's like a sweet kind of alcohol smell um but we'll let the lip product speak for itself so that's the shade of what it looks like a very very beautiful color i can see why it's like 1995 because that shade was like all the rage back in the day during that time like a nudie mauve type of shade and i can definitely see that to get those vibes from it um, so I'll be excited to try that for sure. We're going to see how that dries down here in a second. Um, allow that to do its thing. So that is worth $20. It is a full size product at 2.5 milliliters. Um, what it does say though about the product, inspired by the biggest beauty trends of the 90s, this liquid lipstick coats lips in a rosy brown pigment that stays put from your morning coffee through your happy hour cocktails. And then for more reasons to love it, even though it's matte, the comfortable formula does, doesn't feel drying or flake off your lips during the day. And then about the brand, performance, um, vibrance, and innovation are at the heart of every product crafted by this LA-based cosmetics brand. So there is that. Then next, it looks like we have a Vizzy Art palette in here. Okay. This is the Petite Pro Troyes Troy Troy palette. Yeah, Petite Pro Troyes palette. It's, it's what it says right there if you guys can see that. Or I'll put it on the screen like I always do. This is a full size product. It is worth $30 um, and it is eight grams. It says this compact is the perfect travel size, packs some serious punch, complete with eight super pigment and blendable shades and matte satin shimmer finishes and it's got everything you need to channel your inner makeup artist. So it just slides right on out. This is what the packaging looks like. For some of you guys, you may have seen this packaging before because I do kind of use the same packaging in the bronzer that I have by them as well. Um, okay, this is kind of getting stuck. There's that. Okay, so opening it up, we've got the shades. We've got this on here. I'm a little scared though because do you guys see how wonky that shade there's these shades are kind of sitting in here if you guys can kind of see like I don't know what's going on with this um it's just it's just sitting in there really wonky like it didn't get put in there correctly um I think I can push it down I think these pop out honestly because they've always had the little divots to where you can kind of um take them out of the pan I'm afraid to keep pushing on it though and I've got powder everywhere um this palette is super duper cute it is has like plastic packaging on the inside kind of kid like um but then the outside packaging is really like nice and prestige um but i apologize that some of that dust got on my hands and it's on this outside but like the the top part are mattes then i've got these shimmers down here i do have another vizier palette it's the only other one i have and it's completely all mattes um, I've never tried their shimmer formula, but I just don't think this palette is from, for me, and I would feel really bad keeping this, um, just to say that I have it. I don't know, but that green shade right there is calling my name. That looks really beautiful for tomorrow. Okay, it's, you're making me, you're making me keep it. It's a little travel size. 
you know what? I don't really own anything from Vizzy Art, so I'm gonna keep it. I'm sorry, I'm keeping it. Um, but I will add that into my eyeshadow palette um, collection over there, and then we're gonna go ahead and keep going on because now that we've had that eyeshadow palette um, in our collection, guess what? There's another eyeshadow palette that was um, I picked. So the items that were chosen for me were the R and Co and the Vizzy Art, and the three items I picked was the Gerard Cosmetics, the um, MOTD Cosmetics. A highlighter and last we have this brand called Carmella Cosmetics and this is the Defiance palette so let's go ahead and get this out of the packaging and see what we've got so first off that looks stunning I love that um, and then it slides right on out and let's go ahead and see what it says about this so it says this is $35 it's 10 grams um, it has eight gorgeous shadows that have, um, whoa, I can't read. These eight gorgeous shadows equal infinite, infinite gorgeous eye moments. Mix and match the mattes and shimmer shades to create a stunning look for work, weekend, or everything in between. And then it says it's made without GMOs, uh, phthalates, to class in some other word, I can't, petrochemicals, synthetic fragrances, or talc. And then it says, uh, Carmella Cosmetics is dedicated to supporting women. They donate 10% of their net profits from every lipstick to organi organizations. To, oh my God, can I speak? They donate 10% of the net profits from every lipstick to organizations devoted to women's healing and empowerment. So, this again is what it looks like. Again, this is $35 for this eyeshadow palette. And when we open it up, this is what it looks like. So, if I can remove this really quickly and have this slide off, you guys can see a little bit better of what this palette looks like. So, it does have one, two, three, four, five mattes. So you've got like this nude shade right here. Then you've kind of got this mauvey pink shade, a light brown, and then you've got a medium brown, and then a black, and then you've got three shimmers. Um, this one kind of looks like a taupey type of shade that has, it looks like almost like a blue reflect in it. And then this one kind of is like a coral orange one that has like pink reflect in it. And then this one's kind of like a more darker, mauvier pink shade um, that looks like it has some pink and brown reflex that are in it. So that is what that eyeshadow palette looks like. That is worth $35. And this one will definitely be going into the giveaway for you guys for this month. So without further ado, that is everything I got in this bag. Now obviously you guys do know that I will always put the stuff into the bag that we got, which I forgot to show you in the beginning. This is what it looks like. Some geometric shapes kind of looks like 3D-esque. Really fun um, spring colors, but everything will be going into this bag and then obviously we shipped off to you guys. So let me grab the other, other product and then let's go ahead and dive into this giveaway so you guys can see what you're getting. All right, so my camera battery is about to die and then I drop a product on the floor. Um, so I'm going to show you guys everything that you guys are getting in to this giveaway for this month. First, starting off with the biggest one, which I got in BoxyCharm. This is the Frank Body Sculpting Body Hydrator. Super cute and it, like a cute little coffee cup. And then you also get to reuse it after you finish the product. Then we've got these Stay Calm um, Soothing Sheet Masks. I forget what the brand is called. It's called Give Me... Give them LLA skin, so that's what the brand is called for that one. And then the eyeshadow palette I just showed you, also the highlighter that I just showed you, and then from the Walmart haul we have the sparkling uh, hard candy glitterazzi lip kind of duo that we've got here going on, and then the last thing is by Ren Skincare. You guys know this is a kind of like a prestige brand. It is the Brightening Dark Circle Eye Cream. So you have a total of six products going into this month's giveaway for you guys. Again, all the details for the giveaway will always be linked down or will be, always be in the description box for you guys. 
And yeah, that's pretty much it. So I love you guys so, so much for being here and being a part of this video. You guys know the gist. If you like videos like this, give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below so you never miss a video with me, your girl, Senior D, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.